whole operating room is in 20 minutes. You can open it, and as you can see, it's working inside a class of school. Big success. The surgery room is actually a sterile bubble with a small opening for the surgeon's head and hands. This arrangement saves the need to perform a long sterilization process for the patient's whole body and facilitates the performance of complicated surgeries under difficult conditions. What made possible to perform the surgery here is this uh, MOR, mobile operating uh, room, uh, which was made in Israel, and this is uh, quite a very nice and, and novel idea. It actually creates a bubble. It has a nylon cover with two layers, and everything inside is sterile and uh, it is isolated completely from what going on the outside. What we have inside this room is exactly the same machinery and the same instrument that we can see in any you know, operating theater in the world. So one can form state-of-the-art surgery in any place in the world, even in the most isolated place, such as this place. Good luck. Performing as a moving assembly line, each surgery lasts about 15 to 20 minutes. Time is very important factor in this, because if we bring the doctor for a few days to the mountains, they have to make as much as possible surgeries. In this surgery room, everyone works with protocol. Everyone knows exactly what he's doing in any moment. She's finished the surgery, and we enter the next one to prepare him. The bandages are taken off at the end of the treatment. Although the eye might still hurt, the goal is achieved. <laughs> <laughs> In a few days, the patient's vision will improve and they will see again the beauty of Nepal. And in a country like Nepal, there is no doubt but to see it in 20 by 20.